What's going on everybody? This is Jay from Maji and Jay. Today the purpose of this video is to unbox my first TV box ever that I got from the website pandaworld.com and I paid for this model $109 but that didn't include the DHL shipping method which I actually recommend 100% don't go with the free shipping method guys it's going to take forever to arrive and what I like about this TV box is that it is running the Windows 8.1 and it is called the Peepo X7. The Peepo X7 is basically a tablet just without the monitor allowing you guys to connect it anywhere around your house that has a monitor or a TV which is something that I use a lot because I happen to see myself all the time connecting my laptop into my TV so this way I don't have to do that any longer and I can still use my laptop without any interruptions. I also got this keyboard from a local retail store and it comes already with a mouse so this is going to be very cool guys again I am new to this product so I really can't wait to unbox it which we're going to do right now and see what's inside of the package as you guys can see once again I chose DHL and this came from the website Panda Will and Panda Will has never failed me before they are a very good website and they do accept PayPal for those who are interested in knowing so you're always safe with them nothing gets damaged and here we can see that everything is well protected let's go ahead and open it from the top and I've been waiting for this now. It took about, I would say, almost a week for them to process. The order took a little bit longer because for a short period of time they were out of stock. But now they have the stock back again on there, guys. And I think that's going to be uh, because of the price. This is only $109. And it's carrying the Intel Atom C3736F, which is a quad-core processor. And it's clocked at 2.1 gigahertz. It comes with 2 gigabytes of RAM and 32 gigabytes of internal storage, but that can be upgraded. Now here, the first thing you can see on the front is going to be the logo for the Peepo. That's the brand. We got the model X7, Windows TV box. And this is carrying right now the Windows 8.1, as I mentioned earlier. Earlier, and it has the Intel Atom inside here we can see that it seems like I got the white color version on the left side you got a barcode just for inventory purposes and the box is pretty much plain this is a very simplistic box nothing very I would say nothing very cool here then on the back of this box we're going to have the specifications that we have in four different languages the first one we got here is English we can see that the CPU is in fact the Intel Atom it is the 3736F and it's clocked at 2.1 gigahertz. We got Windows 8.1 and then it comes here with the Office 365 as well. It has the Bluetooth 4.0, it supports Wi-Fi and so on. So here we're going to go ahead and unbox it and see what's inside of this box. So here we're going to find the box itself. As we can see on the back here, I can already notice that we have a Wi-Fi antenna. This also supports four USB ports. We got two here and then two on the front. You also see here the power button together with the uh, LED light. We got the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And then on the back is going to be the HDMI port. We got the ethernet port. And then here we have the charging port as well and supports TF cards up to 64 gigabytes. The casing here is made of aluminum and then this is going to have about seven inches of width. The height is going to be about five inches and thickness is going to be almost two inches here. So this is very, very nice guys. Again, it is fully made of aluminum. So let's go ahead and put this aside. On the top, we got the People logo. Then inside of the box, we also got some other contents in here. We got a warranty card. This is very nice. I'm not sure if this is going to work here from the USA as it does have pretty much everything is in Chinese. Inside, we're going to find the charger so that we can hook it up. At least it's not a battery operating one. So here we can see the voltage information and whatnot. Uh, this is very cool. It is just a standard charger, just as we will see from any laptop. Then in here, we're going to find a divider. It's made of plastic. And then inside, we have nothing else, guys. So we don't have many accessories this time. And you do have to get your own keyboard. The great news is that it supports Bluetooth. So it should be a piece of cake to connect any accessory into it, including remote controllers for gaming and whatnot. So here, let's go ahead and put all this aside. I'm going to get my monitor and see how this baby boots up. Now that we have connected the Peepo X7 successfully to my TV, here you guys can take a look at the connection that I use. Basically all I did was connect the HDMI to the HDMI port on the Peepo X7 itself and then connect it to the TV, connect the power source and then finally install a TF card if you guys wish to upgrade the memory. In this case I have a 16 gigabyte one but I plan to get a 64 gigabyte. Now make sure that when you guys install it, it's going to be upside down as we can see here, otherwise you can break the port. And then finally on the front I connected my Bluetooth adapter as you guys can see right here and then finally I powered it on and everything seems to be working well. Now we're going to focus on the screen so that way we can see what we have here. 
already YouTube and now after everything has been completed this is everything that you guys are going to find on your desk or wherever you guys are at in your living room and so on you're going to have the TV itself or the monitor you have the people x7 box and then finally you're going to have the keyboard this is my wireless keyboard and it has an integrated mouse already in it I just bought this from a local retail store and I paid $29.99 I probably could have find it a little bit cheaper but again I was in a hurry today I wasn't expecting this package this seems like a very nice product and the first thing that we're prompted here with is going to be the language selection so here we're going to fast forward everything so that way I can jump you guys into the UI of the system and now in this section here guys we can notice that this already comes with a built-in Wi-Fi this is definitely great and the antenna is going to be the white part that we see here the plastic one as I mentioned earlier so let's go ahead and connect here to my Wi-Fi router And now that the Peepo X7 has booted up, here we can find the UI of the system. This is definitely Windows 8.1. And I did forget to mention that this is going to be playing back in 1080p resolution. As a matter of fact, this little monitor that I'm using or TV is in 1080p. This is definitely great. I'll be using this a lot for YouTube videos. I'll be using it for Skype. I'll be using it for many purposes because I'm tired of connecting my computer. And that's sometimes it could be some sort of an inconvenience because I'm editing videos, I'm using it, and I need it all of the time. But sometimes for entertainment purposes I have to interrupt my usage with it which is not very cool guys I think that this little gadget here is going to do very well and again I got this from pandaworld.com the price is only $109 so I think it's quite affordable as well and then here we're going to find all these system specifications this is the people x7 we can find there the Intel Atom CPU C3736 F now this is going to be clocked at 2.1 gigahertz but here's reading it as 1.3 we have 2 gigabytes of RAM and 32 gigabytes of internal storage but we can upgrade it as I mentioned earlier guys with a TF card and now that's going to be it guys for this video I just want to give you an overview of what comes inside of the box and how the system looks but of course on a separate video I'll be performing some uh, gaming tests and also playing around the system so that way you guys can see how well it is performing and like always if you guys do have any questions please don't forget to comment down below like the video subscribe for more thanks for watching and have a good one